This is the main interface for Citroen, a C++ interactive interpreter. This project came about to create an easy to use tool that lets beginner programmers better grasp the C++ language. As you can see here, Citroen is comprised of three main panels. A program panel in which you write your code, a state display panel where you view the scope of your variables, and an interpretation console where you can view the output of your program. We also have a menu toolbar in the upper left where you can open or save files, perform your editor functionality, or your run options. Here we also have a menu of buttons for shortcuts to these functions. And we also have hot keys implemented for many of them. Now I'm going to write a quick factorial function to show you Citroen in use. As you can see here, the undo and redo buttons work properly, and as you would expect. You can also select text, copy it to the clipboard, or cut it, and paste it to where you please. And if you notice, as you write code, line numbers will appear as new lines occur, and the line you are currently on will be highlighted in red. As you finish writing your program, you can come up here to File, Save As, and save your code. For this demo, we're going to run the Run All function of the interpreter. This will interpret every line of code in the program. Once this is done, you can come down to the Interpretation Console and view the output of your program. When factorial was called with 5, the result was 120, and when it was called with 1, the result was 1, which shows that the interpretation works correctly. If you come up here to the Run menu, you can view all of the Run options. By selecting Run to Breakpoint, a dialog box will appear in which you enter the line you wish the interpreter to stop after. We chose 9. You can see here that line 9 is highlighted, and the interpreter ran for lines 1 through 9, and stopped after calling factorial with 5. It did not interpret the rest of the program. You can then click this button to stop execution, and prevent the interpreter from finishing the run. Citroen can also detect syntax errors. To show this, we will write in an error in our code at line 12. Now, when we run the interpreter, we will be prompted in the interpretation console in the bottom right that we have made an error at line 12. Citroen can also open files already existing on your machine. Here we open a pre-written program that displays how Citroen can handle all of the math operations including the ternary operator and can handle arrays. This program will compute the max value of that array. Now we will demo the run step option of Citroen which interprets one line of code at a time. As you can see the line being interpreted is highlighted. Conditional statements like if and while are highlighted in green if true and red if false. Here you can see me use the run step option using a hotkey F1. Citroen also supports a timed run option which can be selected in the run menu. This option will interpret code line by line at a provided pace. In this case one step will be taken every half second. Thank you for watching our video, and we hope you like using Citroen, a C++ interactive interpreter.